I've received uh, numerous calls from churches or members of churches asking about the legalities of carrying guns under the Louisiana Concealed Handgun Permit Statute inside of that place of worship. You know, up until a few years ago, uh, there uh, was no way to legally carry the gun in the church under the Louisiana Concealed Handgun Permit Statute. However, you know, with the uh, increase of violence, and I don't mean you know necessarily increase of of worst case scenario active shooter incidents at church, but just increase in violence in general. Uh, through that, uh, they uh, were looking, churches were looking to be able to, to create uh, security teams, that they wanted to be able to allow certain members of those teams to be able to carry firearms. And so we amended uh, the statute to be able to grant that authority. So subsection U gives the authority uh, to the church uh, to give permission to specific individuals, uh, certified law enforcement officials, or uh, uh, anyone who is authorized to carry that concealed handgun under the Louisiana Concealed Handgun Permit Statute. Now, if they're going to give this permission, uh, which has to come from the authority of the church, the pastor, the minister, then they also have to notify the congregation that they are granting this permission. Uh, being that they don't have to be specific on who is carrying, uh, but they do have to notify the congregation that they are allowing uh, certain people to carry firearms. In addition to the permission, in addition to the notification, anyone who is authorized to carry the firearm concealed uh, or authorized to carry that firearm there under this portion of the statute also has to receive an additional eight hours of tactical training and this training has to be conducted on an annual basis for as long as that person has permission to be able to carry there. Uh, now, there's no state outline on what this training uh, has to include, uh, but it does say that it has to be eight hours and it does say it has to be tactical training. If you have questions on what I believe should be in that training, or if you're looking for that training, or if you just have general questions on security inside of a church, don't hesitate to reach out to us. Uh, thanks for taking the time to watch the video. Barrett Kendrick with Barrett Co Training.